you're not using AI to improve your processes and operations as a business person, you are wrong. Today, I bring to you one AI tool that has been totally phenomenal and I have used it for presentation to stakeholders and top management in my office where I work and they were totally impressed. I know you're used to PowerPoint. I was used to PowerPoint as well, but this AI brings in a new perspective into how you can present your ideas that is both engaging educative and it's also beautiful somebody can look at it and will be oh like will be smiling while you are presenting even if the idea is boring and the ai tool i am talking about today is pressy so pressy it's um this is the entire outlay of course it has the free version it also has the premium version and if you are for business you can choose if you are a student um you choose whichever one you want and this is the entire layout and the overview i will drop the link of pressy in the description button of this video where you can check it out and see how you can utilize it to actually do a presentation so in today's video i am going to show you how to use pressy to carry out a presentation or to work with a presentation i have created a presentation slides already and i've kept the notes so we are just going to see what is impressive how do you utilize pressy for your presentation and how best can you showcase your skills and your creativity while using pressy so I, I don't have the, the third version of Pressy, so I go for a student version and um, it would ask you to sign in or it would ask you to log in. Um, I've logged in before, I've signed in, I've signed up before, so I would just log in. But if you're, if you're using it for the first time, just get started with it and just log in. So I would log in now. Once you log in, this is what you are going to see. And once you see this, all you have to do is just continue with basic. So I just need to continue with basic and it will ask you to invite your teammates and everything. I will personally just skip it because we are not ready to invite any teammate. So I always, I'm going to advise you to start with students, but whichever one you're going to start with is going to bring out the various um, educator on business, whichever one, since you're on free trial, it will just bring all of them together. So. The good thing about Pressy is that you can record a video, you can create an infographics, you can create a presentation and all of those things. But in this one, we are just going to focus on presentation. Perhaps in my future videos, I will actually show you how to create, record a video using Pressy. So let's just see if we are going to get a presentation or you could skip it. And once you click on the presentation, it should bring out lots of templates. Now, the good thing about Pressy is that it has categories where there is general categories where you can just do any kind of presentation ranging from climate change to education to gender to equity, whatever you want to present, or it could be in sales and business development, marketing, education and nonprofit, HR, there are lots of templates. There are also video templates as well, but since this video is just particularly focused on the PowerPoint presentation, we will stick to the PowerPoint presentation. So in this case, what kind of presentation do you want to do? And you just have to check it out, go through it, which one resonates with you. And uh, this is the entire overview of what the presentation would look like. For example, this is a colorful nature. So it will have the first slide, second slide, third slide, fourth slide, and the fifth slide. Do you get so after you've Put in every single thing about your presentation at the end of the day you are going to see the overview in a first template before you continue in your presentation and that is one thing that is truly mind-boggling while i was using pressy so in this case which one are we going to use because my title of my presentation is going to be five ways to stay creative as a person so what do you think should be the one we should use which one looks very creative and beautiful and gorgeous and lovely and um, intriguing. So you can just go down and look at it and see whatever you want to choose. So yeah, I like this big idea, the big idea. So this is the template we are going to use. So I'll just click on use template and then title of your presentation. So creativity, I like using cab locks. Creativity is the title of presentation. Now, the, the, the thing is that you have to choose this. For people that are on paid version, you can decide who to share it with. But since we are not on paid version, it will not allow us to use this. So we have to share it with anyone on web as well. So if you want your presentation to be personalized, if it is data that you don't want to share to an entire public, ensure that 
you have a, a paid version. Ensure you read to their terms and conditions before you start using Pressy. So this is the entire overview of Pressy and uh, how do we begin? Do you want to begin yet to add title? I would just advise that this is the overview. So don't touch anything on overview. Just come down to the first one and then you can start your addicting. You can start adding whatever you want to add. You can addict it. Now you also have to understand that Pressy has just five slides. Do you understand? It has just five slides. However, there are ways that you can add slides, but today's presentation I won't focus on that. I would make another video on how to show you how to add slides. Now, when you open this, it will show you if you want to change the color, if you don't like the background, you can change the background and all those things. Of course, the lock ones shows that this is a premium version. You can change the background to see whichever one you like, or you can return it to how it was as well so you have the liberty to actually um edict have the li liberty to see just change it to see what fits you better i think i really love this i mean is it just me <laughs> it, it looks very great and amazing so yeah these are the beautiful things you can actually do with pressy to suit your personality or to suit your test as a person so whatever it is you feel you want to do you can always do that so there is style here there's frame here you can add text there is media you can add images or video these are shapes these are story block and there are more and if you made a mistake and you want to go by you can just easily undo okay like i added color and i don't want to really add color i want to go back to the first um frame which is the first frame that we first had when we opened this guy so what was the first frame this was the first frame so we are going to stay with the first frame so we are clicking to add text so already like i said i've already um created my text and this is my text so we are just going to start with the title which is five ways to remain creative and um i'll add that you can choose to bold this, change your uh, uh, font style as well. So uh, if you like this color, then you keep it. If you don't like this color, you can change it. But I like the color, so I'm just going to remain with the color. And then five ways to remain creative. Then you can uh, put it in italics or not put it in italics. You can change the font size. You can change the, the title or the subtitle and that so this is our topic five ways to remain creative you can also move it around if you don't like where it's positioned you can actually move it around so what are the five ways to remain creative and this is this and you add the subtitle to it if you want to change this to black yeah this is in blue and i want it to be in black just click that and you change it and it turns to black five ways to remain creative and then your subtitle is there and you move into the second frame so what do you want your second frame to be i will just quickly add all the text and then we will come back to see how it works okay guys so i have added all the presentation i've added every of my uh presentation slides and this is the overview of the presentation like i said so i am just going to click on present to see how it actually looks like so start with the presentation of course with the um watermark which is here the pressy um this thing now this is the overview of my presentation once you open your presentation this is how it's going to look like all you have to do is to click on your right arrow on your keyboard and it will move to the next so this is the first presentation five ways to remain creative so and this is the subtitle of my presentation this is how the people that you're giving the presentation are going to see the presentation as you have to move to the second slide understanding creativity so you tell them how do you understand creativity you guys saw how i changed the color you fit it into however you want or how you want to change the background you can change the background of every slide that you want to so this is my third uh, presentation slide so you just keep using your right 
uh, shift key and it keeps going until when until you get to the end of the presentation and yeah voila that is the end of our presentation so once you're done with the presentation you just click on the escape um key on your keyboard and this will usually come out for you to ask you to rate the presentation you can choose to rate the presentation or not choose to rate the presentation it is all good and fine so guys if you have not subscribed to our channel please kindly do that we are growing every day as a community and i'm really super excited for the people that have subscribed so if you are yet to subscribe please support my channel like this video it will help youtube to improve the algorithm and show it to a lot of people that way i can keep adding value to you so one thing i did not mention is to share this presentation is either you download it as a pdf file or you get the link now if you do not have the premium version of pressy you cannot export it as a pdf file but if you are every a free user like i am you can actually um create the link so all you have to do is create the link and then you type uh, the name of your company or the name of the presentation or whatever you do and just click on create link it will click, uh, click the link create the link and you copy the link to wherever you want to um share it with now one thing i did not mention is in this very presentation let's say for example you want to add your company logo to kind of show that wow this is a company and you really want to now in my case now i don't exactly have a company logo to use in my mind but if you want to just use an icon to tell a story in your presentation i would advise that you use this website called flat icon i mean i love this place it's really amazing it gives me lots of hoops icons so you can just come here and search whatever icon you like i like asking questions so you know it, it pops up different gradients of questions icons that you can use you can just start by because every company has a mission statement so once you click on mission it will show you icons of mission you can choose whatever you want download it as a um, copy to clipboard as a png or as um svg whichever one you like and you can take it to your presentation and just paste it on your presentation and it will come up exactly all you have to do is to crop it to wherever point you want to put it now in this presentation i did not have any intention whatsoever to add icons to my presentation thus i did not use it but there are other several presentations that i have done that demanded icons just to tell the story appropriately which i i went to flat icon that very website i just went to to show exactly how to do this so that is how i actually use Pressy to do my presentation and my management are very happy my stakeholders are very excited because they see and i'm bringing creativity into the company and they are embracing ai as well and they are encouraging other people to actually explore the possibility of ai and how it can add value to the company so if you like this video or if this video add value to you tell me are you going to use pressy in your next presentation what was the reaction of your colleagues and also your bosses in your office what was their reaction how did they react to seeing that you use an ai tool to actually create a very captivating presentation tell me in the comment section i will really be excited to hear about it so that is all we have for you today Day. stay blessed and have a truly great life guys please support my channel by subscribing bye